A man from Bradford County picked the hottest week of the year to take his longest walk of the year. He's on a 100 mile mission to end hunger. Newswatch 16's Chris Keating caught up with him earlier today. Bill Fry has been doing a lot of walking this week. He's an athletic trainer at Pivot Physical Therapy in Troy. For nearly a decade, he has walked 101.5 miles from Tunkhannock to Canton every summer, all to help end hunger. The soreness is starting to get out, and then as uh, yesterday was a long day, uh, that really kind of pushes it out, and today I feel pretty good. Fry sometimes walks alone, but had a crew with him when Newswatch 16 caught up with him on Route 14 between Troy and Canton. So my role with Bill is to make sure that he's safe and hydrated. Um, I try to stay in the area throughout the week. It's been an important week because of the amount of heat that we've had. Fry splits the trip into five days. He stopped at Milky Way Farms for a milkshake on his final day. The dairy business has donated to Fry's cause nearly every year. We just believe in what they're doing and we just always support the cause. Um, I wish it could be more. We're raising money for CHOP who may people may be associated with them and not in some way, but it's just knowing that people are willing to support them. Uh, it, you know, it just makes everything worth it. CHOP stands for Child Hunger Outreach Partners. The organization based out of Tawanda helps put food on the table for those in need. They do a lot of uh, work in our school communities, districts, uh, just making sure that there's, uh, there's food in the schools for kids who may not have a lot at home. Um, and also for uh, families in the area that are struggling. If you would like to donate to Fry's Cause, you can visit the link found on our website, WNEP.com. Chris Keating, Newswatch 16, Bradford County.